here we are in the new Camus. It was kind of a rush. Everything got thrown in the boat, kind of in a rush to get ready for some fishing because we got it in June. And now I'm finishing up some organization. I just thought I'd share a tip. So for years, I was using these gallon Ziploc bags and I've just got, I'm trying to get rid of the rest of them. They're crusty. They get all milky. They tear holes in them. They don't last that long. You try to write something on there and now I can't read what it says anymore. And they just go to junk and they end up just replacing them at least once, you know, every year, if not twice a year. And it just becomes kind of a waste of time. So I'm working on migrating everything. Last year, uh, middle to beginning of the season, I started trying the Arsenal Italian bags, which are these. And there are some other manufacturers that make similar bags, but I've been a fan of these. Zipper closure, heavier construction. These have been in the boat for almost two years. This was probably a few months of sitting in the boat. So these go to crap super easy. They kind of become a waste of time and money over time, even though they're cheap to start with. And then also they just kind of bunch up and you can't see what's in them and you're like sorting through your box. These are nice because they kind of, they'll stay up, right? You can like set these up in a row in your compartment and they'll stay. So far they've stayed very clear. They've got a reliable zipper that doesn't bust most of these fail and then everything just spills out in the bottom of your boat because the zipper doesn't, you can't get that Ziploc. They hold a label really well. You could probably write it on a marker as well if you want. Um, if you guys don't have one of these label makers, I'll put a link down in the description on Amazon below. Super good to have and you can label your tackle boxes. You can label just about everything in your boat. Super handy, extra organization. Just having those labels on things on the top of your 3700s and boxes makes it super tight what they are and less time searching around and you know wasted time is wasted cast and that's less bites and less fish but so i've got all kinds of these now and i'm, and I'm kind of culling out the last couple and getting rid of these and, and migrating everything over so we've got you know a bag for tactical minnows we got a bag for nico we got some brush hugs this one i haven't labeled the other nice thing is you don't really need to label them because they stay clear and you can kind of see what's in there right we got a mojo bag We've got a bag for beavers and then I keep like my bulk storage up here and these bigger blue totes are on pegs and then as these get empty I just kind of refill them into the boat. I used to put these in the boat and I just ended up taking way too much tackle with me and it was too much weight. Not just for soft plastics, I will throw you know random things in here, buzz baits, things like that. You know even like a whopper plopper in there with the hooks doesn't really cause a problem. Uh, I've got a bunch of Warrior spinner spinnerbaits in this one so they're really handy to organize, keep things clean and declutter. And they're really handy when you go on the run as a co-angler or a bank fisherman if you're like, hey, I know I'm like going to flip today, right? Like, oh, we're going to a grass lake. So I'll grab my flipping baits. I'll grab my Nico baits, maybe my stick worms, right? And then just jump in a buddy's boat with some hooks and tackle and, and, and go fishing. You can shove them in backpacks. They're really like fungible. You can do a lot of things with them. Or you can keep a couple extra of these and like pack them out with like, hey, I'm going to grab a couple bags of this, a couple bags of this. And you grab those and you load them out, right? You can kind of build yourself kind of a custom, you know, two or three of these bags as a co-angler. You can kind of build what you need for the day. These are all the me medium battalion bags. They make a larger and a smaller size if you want to have a little more customization. You can get them at arsenalfishing.com. I will have a code down below. It is HelloBass15 if you want to save 15%. I'll also link down to this stuff below. But this is the system I'm going through. And it's saving me time, saving me money. And it's making me more efficient on the water, which is getting me more casts, more flips, more bites, and more checks. If you're into tackle hacks and things like that, make sure you check out this playlist on the screen right here.